Deadpool and Wolverine. Yeah. Just became the biggest box office ever in the history of motion pictures for an R-rated film. Oh, yeah, I saw that. What I didn't know was who it dethroned. Oh, yeah. Joker. Yep. I didn't realize Joker was the biggest R-rated box office success of all time. Well, you are a moron. Welcome back to our stupid acts of Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, for more juicy content. content. Thank juicy. you for supporting some Patreon. Follow us on Instagram, super like a button. Yeah, juicy, juicy, juicy. Welcome back. Today, uh, we got another trailer that dropped. It's just, a, I think it was yesterday. Yeah. And it's for Kangana's new film, it's Emergency. I feel like I've heard about this one for a long time. And I don't know, like, uh, it, it's just, I don't know why it's taking forever to come out. But it's about that one, uh, I think she's playing a real person. Uh, let's see. India is Indria. Indria is India. Uh, so oh, Indira. Is this Indira, about Indira, Indira Gandhi? Witness the story of the most powerful woman in the history of India and the darkest chapter she wrote in his life. That's got to be a, that's it's that's got to be Indira Gandhi. We've seen stuff about it. Like I said, it's been uh, like we've seen like I feel like we've seen a teaser and glimpses for I, a I, long. I remember time. that a, lo a while back. Uh, don't know why. Like it. And is she, I know she's not. I thought she said she retired. She did, but this was obviously filmed before, before she was elected. Yeah. I wonder if she'll be doing any I'm press for this. I don't know. Because uh, she has said that she's not going to act while she's in office. Yeah. I mean, she may have changed her mind. She can do that, obviously. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so both are time consuming, I suppose. Here we go. Satta. Satta yani. Wow. She looks like her. Yeah. Sam, are you with me in this? I am with India, Prime Minister. That's who Vicky played in you the have movie, right? You declared war on Pakistan. You should have rethought this decision. You have weaponry. We have courage. That's all it takes. Here we are. Okay. शिमला अग्रीमेंट तो भारत की बहुत बड़ी हार है ये होता है जब कोई व्यक्ति देश सेवा के लिए सत्ता के लिए लड़ता है उन सबकी नजर आपकी कुर्सी पर आई थिंक इट इज आई थिंक दैट इज नाउ योर रॉन्ग केयर संपूर्ण व्यवस्था बदलने का एक ही रास्ता है संपूर्ण क्रांति क्या बैड न्यूज़ है जेपी शिमला अग्रीमेंट रेलवे स्ट्राइक व्हिच वन संजय अपनी कुर्सी की रक्षा करना तुम लोगों का कर्तव्य है एक बार छोड़ दी तो कहीं ये देश एक खुली जेल बन जाएगा पूरी कैबिनेट की सहमति आवश्यक होती है इंडिया की मैं ही कैबिनेट हूँ आज सब कोर्ट्स बंद अखबार ऑफिस प्रिंटिंग प्रेस सबकी बिजली काट दो ने सोचा था कि लोकतंत्र का ऐसे कला घुटेगा हर आवाज जो उसके खिलाफ उठेगी कुचल दी जाएगी आपातकाल भारत के लोकतंत्र पे काला धब्बा है सारे देश में तुम्हारे खिलाफ नफरत का माहौल पैदा होता जा रहा है नफरत 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 और पीला क्या है कुछ इस देश से तुम जानते हो कि हमारी पार्टी को क्या चाहिए पार्टी पार्टी में वो चाहिए किसान चाहिए है खालिस्तान India is Indira, and Indira is India. Dang, looks good. Interesting. Um, why? What's up? No, it's interesting. I my 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 hesitation. Um, 
is based upon um, several factors. One being the how little I know. I mean, I know of her, and I know some of what transpired under her rulership. Um, so obviously, one of the things that always occurs to me when you're telling a true story is how how uh, faithful will be to the telling of of what happened in history. Mm -hmm. I feel that way with any historical pick. Um, I I admittedly have some pause because of some of the things I know. It, it's the same way I felt about um, oh, what's her name? Good grief. Come on, Rick. I have no idea. Yeah, you do. Um, doggone it. Thelma and Louise. There's only two actresses in Thelma and Louise. She's one of them. Mm. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, what happened? Um, in the 80s and the 90s, her politics were far more prominent mm. than her artistry. Gotcha. And it became impossible for me to separate her personhood mm. from her her artistry. Yeah. All I could see was the was the political activist whenever I saw her films, and I couldn't disassociate myself from yeah. that. Uh, and and the, I didn't know that I, I didn't actually see that she directed it as well. Oh, I didn't see I that didn't either. See that I thought I it didn't was see just her either. acting. I didn't know this is a directing slash acting venture for her. I didn't know has she directed in the past. Don't know. She's also a producer and a part writer. This is her kind of baby, huh? JV Prakash Kumar is the composer. Um, and it was Anupam Kerr. You got that one correct yeah. there. Um, I thought, I don't know. I literally know nothing about this lady. Oh, really? Um, like nothing. I've never even seen the movie Gandhi. I well, know. no relate, no relation, no relation, no sure. relation. Okay. Just they happen to have the, the same, same last name. name. Okay. Um, but it's a good last name to have is, in Indian politics. I suppose. She is a very controversial person. I, in, I know in we've Indian seen her character history. in stuff because I recognized yeah. a little uh, the, the iconic hair kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so I don't know much. But I've seen in interviews of, of her. In terms of um, the film, it looked like it could be a really good film. Uh, obviously, her acting looked really good. Everybody you're, else's you're, acting looked really good. You're not gonna you're not gonna get bad acting. Yeah, with the, Kandana, uh, the screen the the cinematography looked really good. Uh, it looked like it could be a good political drama. Like I said, I I know nothing. Of, no, it, of, it, of the story. So yeah, um, there's there's th that for me is my biggest. I have I have pretty sizable caution mm. in in what the historicity will be and what the motives are of the totality of the film, um, and and. It's hard for me to, she has been, she's so, I mean, I don't even, I don't even follow her. She's in politics. But she is, she has been so vocal yeah. about things politically that it's yeah. impossible for me to disassociate who she is as a political person and her stances on politics yeah. uh, from who she is as a, as an actor. Based on the true events. And that, creator, because she's more than an actor. Oh obviously. yeah, on this she's everything. Uh, based on the true events that unfold in 1975, the Chronicles of India's that took place under the leadership of Miss Indra Indira Indira Gandhi, yeah. one of the most powerful women in Indian history. I know we've seen her, but that character before. Um, yeah, person, she's got some. Character. They use the word dark history, and that is oh, yeah. very true. Oh wow. Um, yeah, let us know what you think about this. If 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 uh, does it look like it'll be. A faithful telling does it look like uh it, this is going to be polarizing be interesting i mean everything she does is polarizing yeah it? this is going to be polarizing um but it, i mean in terms it, if you take all that away in terms of a film it looked like it could be a good film i have uh, no doubt so i have no, no just talk about the filmmaking yeah. aspects the the acting wise it looked like it was shot really well um all that kind of stuff no but just he, that alone whatever you may feel personally there is no doubting her talent as an artist yeah, she's that great. you just you cannot she's deny that very good she's actress. very talented uh, I has she directed before you guys have to and that i don't know, know. How, how is her directing slash writing i guess she's one of the writers she's a part of the story writing here but there was also a dialogue by other people screenplay and an associate director uh, associate writers i mean yeah it says that she is responsible for, for the story. story though yeah that's that is the juggernaut right there. um and right. then the, everyone else comes in to add the dialogue and the additional dialogues. But story 
that's her. Did it say it's releasing uh, in theaters or is it OTTs? Oh, it's got to be a theatrical release. It's Z, so be sh- I'd be shocked if this wasn't a theatrical yeah, release. Yeah, probably. Um, I don't know, like, you could hardly tell that was him. Too. I know. I mean, you could tell once you're like, oh, yeah, that is on Uh Where do we know her from? We do know her. Oh, yeah, my goodness. Oh, yeah, we've seen her before. Seen her a lot. Manisha mm-hmm. uh, Kurala. Kurala. Manisha Kurala. So we've seen, we've seen her in several things. Is it like recent though that we saw something in or no? Um, I don't remember what the last thing was that we saw her in. I swear I thought it was some. Oh, she was in Love Stories as well. Oh, that was uh, it. Uh, Hiramandi. Ah, uh, Hiramandi. Yep. Um, she was the lead in one of those. That's why. Uh, anyways, let us know what you thought about this. Are you excited for this? Uh, what are your thoughts on it? How did it look in terms of being faithful to uh, who that person um, in Indira? And, and, yeah, Indira Gandhi. Indira and, and actually as, if, was. As best as you can, maybe too late at this point because of the amount of comments already, but try to be as compassionate, kind, and friendly as possible on the comments. I don't what? Know. Never! Uh, it all helps the algorithm. It's fine. Uh, let, let us know uh, what you think about this if you're excited for it down below. Just-